With the 17th overall pick, the Grey Cup champions Toronto Argonauts select from Bishop's University, defensive back Jermaine Gabriel. May 6, 2013. It was more than just draft day for Jermaine Gabriel. It was a homecoming, a day he never thought would come true. I said a, a couple of prayers, you know, that, that would hopefully Toronto would draft me and bring me back home closer to my family and whatnot. But I really didn't think that Toronto was going to draft me. I never heard anything from them. So to get that call from Scott Milanovic, it was just, it was just crazy. Born and raised in Scarborough, Gabriel traveled across the country to keep his football dream alive. And it sure wasn't easy. After joining McGill University out of high school, he transferred to Bishops and played two years for the Gators before quitting to help support his single mother and sister as best he could. He worked as a janitor before moving to Halifax as a mall cleaner and then Calgary as a construction worker where he also joined a junior football league. As exhausting as carrying wheelbarrows of gravel hours before his practices was, his eyes were always on the prize. I told myself I was going to play football once I was in grade three. I was going to be a professional football player so I made sure that you know I had one plan and I just stuck to that plan. It was hard. I was tired all the time, you know, and I just counted down the days until draft day and I said, if I don't go hard, I'm going to have to come back and do this construction job again. So I just kind of stayed motivated. When the Argonauts drafted Gabriel, it ended his cross-country tour and brought him back to where his football life began. It brought him home to his mother, whom he hadn't seen in two years. Oh, yeah, as soon as, as soon as the Argonauts called me, my mom called me right after, and as soon as I answered the phone, everyone was like screaming in the background for like two minutes and whatnot. So it was very emotional, you know, they were in tears and whatnot, just happy to see me again. After thriving on special teams in his rookie year, Gabriel has become a focal point on defense at the free safety position, and his coaches are raving about him. He's an excellent blitzer. He's, he's got good speed. He's smart. Um, He's a big hitter, so he's got a lot of really good things about him. He makes plays, and I think, uh, you know, he's he's done more than I ever expected he would do, and, and I think he's really become a, a very valuable player for us. Now playing ahead of veteran DB Matt Black on the depth chart, the Argos recently rewarded Gabriel with the contract extension. Coach Burke says he's already exceeded expectations and will continue to develop into one of the league's premier safeties. But Gabriel's focus is only on making the team better. I, you know, I just try to stay focused and you know help the guys around me. I know as a free safety, it's your job to make sure everyone's lined up, everyone knows what they're doing. So I just take it on upon myself to be the kind of the quarterback of the secondary. Gabriel has been one of the few mainstays in the Toronto secondary that has seen a considerable amount of turnover in his first two seasons. But at 24 years old, he's quickly becoming one of the leaders on the Argonaut defense. For Argos TV, I'm Gareth Bush.